Hey everyone, what is happening? Well, today we're going to be introducing the mole, chapter 5. Now, what is a mole? You may think it is this animal, but it turns out in chemistry, a huge number is a mole. It's Specifically, it is 602213670000000000000000 atoms or molecules or particles. And you guys will appreciate the fact that people invented scientific notation because it is 6.02 times 10 to the 23. Now, you may ask, well, that's not that big a number. Well, it is a very, very large number. I want you to think about the following items and if we had a mole of them. I want you to think if you had a mole of marbles. So you're talking about that many, 6.02 times 10 to the 23 marbles. What would, what would happen? Well, check this out. Well, would they fill a room? Would they fill a gym? Would they fill a school? Well, a mole of marbles would or cover the entire surface of the earth 50 miles thick. This is to space. That's a lot, just so you guys know. All right. Um, now, what if we had one mole of sand? Will it fill this room? Will it fill this gym? Will it cover Skaha Beach? Well, if you thought, well, maybe it might cover Skaha Beach, actually, it'll cover North America with three inches thick. All of North America. So this is a very, very large number. Okay. Now, it doesn't just have to be atoms, molecules, or particles. It could be apples or oranges or watermelons. It doesn't matter. All right. So in class, after the test, we're going to be looking at a mole and how to find a mole of certain elements. And you're going to be amazingly surprised. All right. Have a good rest of the day.